and they tend to do what's best for the American people. They're not always right. Some of them are corrupt, can't be avoided in politics, but you cannot compare that to the Republican Party, which at this point, Republican leadership are 100% corrupt. The ones that are not corrupt are getting kicked out. And they don't act rational. Their actions do not make this country a better place. There are conservative ideas that can definitely benefit this country. There are conservative policies that can be overall a benefit. But that's not what the Republican Party is. They have not governed in over 20 years. And I mean as a party. And this includes the times where they had the presidency, the Supreme Court, and both houses. They have never governed. At no point have they taken power and left our country better than they got. That is that has actually not happened in, I think, over 30 years. It's actually an interesting thing to point out, and I know this isn't descriptive of everything that happened during those years, but ever since Bush, the first one, not the second, ever since Bush, Republicans have left the country with a larger debt than they, than, um, than they had when they were elected. This is 100% of Republican presidents. And 100% of Democrats have left the deficit in better shape. And I think it's true across the board that Democrats in general have left the country in better shape and Republicans have left it in worse. I'm not sure there are any categories where you can look at it, where you can say, ah, they left it better in this way. Because I don't think that's actually happened in the last 30 years. Maybe during the first Bush years, there might have been some things that he did that weren't awful. There might have actually been some positives that he left behind. But ever since him, hasn't happened. I don't think that Biden's highly corrupt. I think that he genuinely wants to do good things. But I also disagree with a lot of the things he has said and a lot of the things he wants to do. But I still think he's better than anyone the right has fielded in over 20 years. Oh, whoops. Shit, shit. I'm coming. Got too busy talking politics. I'm missing the leash. I still managed to give him most of a leash. I gave him two shots. But either way, let's uh, stop talking politics now. Thanks for the free shotgun blast. And then the next free shotgun blast. Oh, ow. How the fuck did that reach me? Good God. So we this is the third time we're facing a set today. We won one, we lost one. Um, a lot of the points I made in those games, I'll be making in this game too. I really hate set. I think that he's one of the most overpowered champions in the game right now. Back the fuck off. Back the fuck off. Dang, I meant to auto that. You can farm under your turret. Thank you. But yeah, either way. We're in the game now. Let's stop talking politics until the game's over. This will probably be my last game today, but I will obviously stick around for a few minutes if there's a discussion. Maybe as much as 30 minutes as that's happened before. We've had interesting discussions after stream, so. Oh! Thought he was gonna go for the grab. Oh, that's right, I'm metal me out. Now I And I wanna read all this text, but I can't right now. Got it. And him! First blood. Mid lane's off to a bad start, and this is Fizz. He's never gonna. Oh! Wait, he got a kill too? Nice. Oh, this was bot. No, that was our. Never mind. I don't know why I thought Fizz and Kindred looked similar. No! God damn it. They were hitting him. I wanted to sneak in that auto to kill that minion, but oh well. Either way, I'm keeping my health up. Obviously. Uh, one of the things that makes him a very unfair champ is the fact that I've got mana and he doesn't. 
Why give a monolith champion this much power? I'm almost out of mana now because that's what it takes to lane against him. Don't know why they thought they could dive me there. Oh, shit. Well, whatever. That's going to need to happen at some point anyways. Is he going to double me me out? Or whatever. They forced me to back. Not the end of the world. Can't even wait for my mana to come back. I stuck. Look how much fucking mana I had to burn there. Yeah, the size of his W is one of the things that really needs trimming. Ow. Damn it, dude. Get the rest of this at least. That's the thing, he still has his teleport, so I need to force it out. It sucks I have to burn this potion, but oh, he is not. You're not gonna land that on me if that was your plan. Ah, oh, couldn't get it. Well, that sucks, he didn't even leave Link. At least I'm not missing farm, but yeah, that really sucks. He didn't even need to fucking leave Link! So I shielded that, but again, I'm gonna need to leave Lane again soon. I'm already out of mana again. Uh. I ain't never lost. You know that, right? He's got, got him. Wow, that level six. Wow, that fucking level six. Woo! That timing could not have been better. Man, the problem was that he flashed in a straight line. If he flashed in an angle, my R would have whiffed, and he would have lived. Really great gank, though, from the Kindred. Fantastic. I was not expecting him to do that much damage, but then again, somebody decided not to back. He had multiple opportunities to back, and he decided to stay. The Kindred showed up, and it was a perfect gank. Something I'm not used to getting, by the way. This is, in fact, the first time I've laned against a set where I actually had a jungler help me. Today, the other two times I laned against them, in each case, I was fucked over by the enemy jungle. And my jungler either did nothing or made it worse. This is the first game where I can't say that. But the game is still young. A lot can happen between now and the end. That opinion might change. Oh, Fizz is screwed. Well, he was never getting out of that. Though I should have avoided. I should have, um, pinged. But that's fine. Man, this is just giving me an opportunity to scale. Got that level six time and could not have been better. I'm really surprised it happened the way it did. I see Mr. Cannon. Sucker. Yeah, normally I don't build this tanky as Urgot this early. I like getting the tight. Oh, fuck. Auto. Really hate that shit. When I try to auto something and it dies before the auto attack animation completes, Urgot will instantly auto attack something else before I have a chance to retarget. Damage is just fucking nauseating. Nice, I actually got both. Yes, you're gonna let me crash this into your turret, whether you like it or not. Cause fuck you. I should not have drank that potion. Didn't need to. <laughs> I 
Ah, uh, that always brings a smile to my face. Just keep in mind, Set can do the same thing. He can also kill wards without needing any um, items to do so. And I'm almost right now. I've got a significant level advantage because he's not even eight. Once I okay, I'm one. I I'm one cannon ahead of him in experience. That's not that big an advantage. But any advantage I would take. Still connected on him. Yeah, I I always thought like the easiest way to solve. The biggest issue that I have with him... Oh, God. Oh, God. No. Oh, God. The easiest way to solve it is just make his W the true damage segment and nothing else. Because right now his W is such a massive ability that it basically can't miss. An enemy like Mordekaiser Q, it's baffling how large an effect it has. auto dude. How does it feel? How does it feel? I don't want to get stunned. Don't punch those. You're being an asshole. The minions deserve better than this. Whatever, I'm hitting nine first, and when I do, he becomes a lunch meat. Although I don't actually have any damage right now. I'm nine now, and I got plenty of vision. Yep, we're now at the point where we can actually fight. Let's see the echo mid. Fizz on too. Did the Fizz get a kill first? Well, he's two and three. He's not doing terrible. It's another game where my team's doing well. Holy shit. Got a lot of cash. I don't know if this is a good opportunity to back, though. I'm just going to stay. It's Kindred Pink Ward. Very interesting. Damn. Is Echo coming? He might be coming towards me. He might spot me backing on this ward. Damn, they got both objectives. Rift Herald and Dragon and fucking Midland, too. Mid going down this early is really bad. The Fizz is 30 CS behind, but he's also 5 plates behind. The two kills he has are nice, but I don't think that gets him even close to his lane opponent right now. Well, I've got Teleport. Let's keep that in mind. Trin's not exactly an easy champion to to teleport gank, so I'm not going to bother with that right now. We'll look for a situation. And now we're a pushing machine. We got our team at. Let's show. Now I'm qualitatively stronger than the set, and that's perfect. He needs kills to be able to be stronger than me at this point. From here on out, I'm better in the 1v1. For a second, I thought that was a pink one. Right, this top side, I should keep that in mind. Got a teleport, but that's already gone. So what does he build? He already has his Gore Drinker. Wow, that is crazy he already has that. I need to get a Gramble Vest ASAP, but I also need to finish my item ASAP. Let's go finish it. Look at him weave those abilities. I really want Bramble Vest as soon as possible to dampen the healing he gets off of this. This also looks like a tabby game. Yep.
Yes, OG Brian. I too have seen, um, oh God, what is that movie called? I love that movie. Oh, you're so gonna die. Yeah, you're dead. You're dead, buddy. You needed to dodge my R and you whiffed. Gotta suck to be you. Nice, that was before I leveled it up. I was patient on my R. I knew I was stronger than him. I think I get the turret then. That was a really stupid play on his part, trying to go for that turret, even burn Flash. God, I had the two brothers. The Irish! It's my favorite movie to watch on St. Patrick's Day. Love that movie. I can hear the music now, too. Love the theme song was fantastic. Wait, you wanna fight me? Wow, they even threw a TP my way. How cute. They really wanted to kill me. I'll take it. That's fine. Three for me. Pretty sure I was not beating the set there. Uh, because his W, I think, it connected right Yeah. I mean, look at this. Half the damage he did to me came from his W's true damage. Half. Fucking half. Is that really okay? A basic ability you probably only put one point into doing that much damage? I don't think so. Pretty sure that's not one of those things that a person considers okay. I still have time for it. Jesus, my team's getting wrecked some more. Why did the Leon just... Oh god, please get out. Oh, just, just get out. I'm watching this too much. I'm completely missing everything else. Good TP, but that's not great. I'm just gonna go for this turret. And then the dragon appears. I'll get the turret. Dragon at this point? Oh god, it's third dragon. That's really bad. I think Kendra dropped the ball on that many. Not gonna do anything. Nothing. Oh wait, might still do something now. Oh, I was gonna eat it. Jesus, the fizz does a lot of damage. Wow, that was just the fizz. My ultimate barely did a thing. I should have spammed my R though. That's my fault. I could have gotten that. Fizz doesn't need kills. It'll help me take the top tier too. Fizz is already working on the bottom one. Though right now I can't ward, so that's kind of a problem. I need to use it as soon as I can to avoid dying to unforeseen circumstances. Alright, looks like I'm gonna get the turn right now. My team is suffering though. Totally balanced, right? And die. Piece of shit. I mean, I'm screwed anyways. Fuck, might as well just die to the turret. Got it! Worth! I was gonna die anyways, and I took the 550 gold and ran. I will take that and call it worth.
Oh man. Oh, this is great. Woo! I'm big now. I am I'm positively huge. I'm at two completed items. Their Echoes 5 and 1 is also two completed items. So right now I'm matched as the most fed. Shut down. Along with our Kindred and our 80 carry. Wow, she's really fed. Jesus, their 80 carry doesn't have a full item and ours has two? That's not right. Whatever, time to go bot. We need to make sure we're bot side for the next dragon fight. Wow, and my team is killing him. I'm heading towards mid, just run. Keep running, Leona, I'm on my way. Oh no, she's dead. God damn, if she had actually gone on them, that would have been really good. We okay. Let's just play this safe. Uh, got one. No! Fuck! Okay, we're fine. We still got it. That was one of those times where I didn't want to leave the Kindred ult because I think I would have died. But I wanted to pull him out of the Kindred ult so he would die. Oops. Say, please kill him. He's weak as shit. Yeah, he's dead. Whew. Oh, man. Oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. Ah, oh, oh. It's gonna be one of those games. High pressure. You gotta have nerves of steel. That was... That was ridiculous. Couldn't make a more perfect politician because she came from the working class and understands the problems that average Americans have. I mean, I don't have any particular feelings for or against her, but I mean, the best kind of politician is somebody who doesn't want to be a politician. They're doing it because they want to do the right thing. They're not doing it because they want to be politicians. That is the perfect politician. They don't exist in American politics. The vast majority are people who want to go into politics and their motives are not what one would call altruistic. I juke you all, assholes. Wait, I still took damage there? The brand actually connected? I thought I dodged everything he threw. Oh, what the hell? Screw you, Trend. Ah, oh, fucking Gale Force. <sighs> yes, that item that bruisers are not allowed to have, but 80 carries can. An enemy has been slain. Fucking hate Gale Force. She definitely would have died without Gale Force. Any other 80 carry item, that would have killed her. I mean, we should just go for it. What's up? The Kindred will show up in a second. And they're left to a 50 50 to take this, and Echo's currently showing himself top since this is free. As long as the Kindred smites, we're good. Uh, uh, no smite, huh? Made what should have been a uh, no-brainer into a nerve-wracking moment. Um, I was not reborn in the depths. I merely refused to die. Unstoppable. I got teleport, but this was not an advantageous spot. Uh, you just leave. I gotta be careful. Yeah, I can't. 
I can't be here. Oh my god, the fear connected! Damn it. Ah, that echo hits hard. I need some magic resist. Well, I don't need magic resist, I just need to complete this item and target it. This. All right, I'm going to wait. Nice, they got the kill anyways. Cool. Yeah, she is badly out of position. She's... Yeah, she... Oh! Yeah, she's screwed. There's no way she's winning this. Um... She's just dying. Please needs to run. That was a really reckless thing for the Fizz to do. I can do this while he's... Wait, I meant to pick the Echo. Whatever. I picked a good target anyways. Both of them are good targets. Oh god, he's dead now too. Nothing I can do to save them. Just have to wait mid for this to push. At least there's no objectives for them to take. Reducing the victor's damage will be a good thing, but I think right now Echo is actually the bigger threat for the moment. Your team has destroyed a no, I'm afraid you're both dead. <laughs> oh, hi. I'm sorry, you want to fight? I'm sorry, you guys want to fight? Oh. Damn, I wonder if I had picked him, would I have won that fight and gotten the kill, the last kill there? Hard to tell, but boy, did that feel satisfying. Did I just single-handedly lead to four of them dying? I think I did. Doc Ock is angry. <laughs> An enemy has been slain. An enemy has been slain. Yeah, it's still a good item against their team. Though I think I do want an MR item as my last one. Because their magic damage threats are the big ones. Oh my. Uh oh. Ooh, good sign. Good sign, yes. Your team has destroyed an inhibitor. No, I did not actually describe that. Donald Trump is not the kind of person. I said specifically, you want somebody who doesn't want to be in politics. Donald Trump wanted to be president. There's a huge difference there. He's a bad person to be a president because he wants to be. The best kind of politician is somebody who doesn't want to be one but feels a responsibility to do it. Donald Trump reveled in being president because of what it meant to him. He never wanted to do anything for this country. He never wanted to do a civic duty. So no, I did not describe Donald Trump. Donald Trump is the antithesis of everything good in humanity. He is the literal manifestation of the evils of capital. Capitalism can be a force for good, but he's basically on the spectrum showing the worst possible outcome. Uh, 
Royale. Boy, did we crush it. Eight and four. Hooray, we won the best out of three. And oh, would you look at this. A set once again brought low. And I was richer than anyone on their team, but we had two people on my team that were richer. So this is actually the best game I've had today, allies-wise. Every other game I've played, it's been either me at the top with one other person or me at the top with one other person and somebody else catching up a little later. So yeah. And yes, we did indeed. We did indeed win the best game.